Yes, guys, how are we? Welcome back to the channel. Um, as you can see, currently in the airport in Weatherspoons waiting for breakfast. Uh, we're going to head over to Marbella today, which is currently 4.27 a.m. And just been through security, took my bag off me, and uh, it's because I'd put half my liquids in the, uh, the actual see-through container. So clearly haven't learned too well off the parents. Um, but yeah, going to go get food now and then head over to gate and uh, get on the plane. Three hours later, finally arrived in Malaga Airport. And it wasn't too um, hot at all, actually, but I think 23 degrees is what peaking today. So, going to head over to Marbella now. I think it's about 40 minutes away in the taxi, um, and then get going. This keeps going off, and I, every time I try and do this video, it keeps going off. Somebody needs to go to their check-in gate. It's currently 5:24. If you can see that, 5:24. Um, to come over to Marbella. Uh, gonna try a few gyms out, pretty dark at home now, but here it's like literal gorgeous sunshine, um, blue skies, not too hot, not too cold. Stepped off the plane about, I wanna say, what, half nine, ten, and it was uh, it was refreshing to say the least. It wasn't one of those where it was just hit you in the face heat, so it's quite uh, quite nice to be here, but yeah, so plan of this weekend is just to get some crazy content. Um, obviously, if you watch episode six and you saw a full week in the life, this is more gonna be hot weather training, so to speak, it's not too hot but not too cold. Um, so a few runs planned in, obviously no bike. Um, the pool, for instance, which I'll show you in a minute, actually. Um, we can maybe do a few lengths, but it's no, it's no 25 meter length pool. Um, so you do, do a little bit of that, a little bit of technique stuff, maybe. We'll see. Uh, but it's mainly to try out um, Real, Club, uh, Real Club Adele, if I'm saying that correct. Uh, try that one out, get some content in there, and just keep pushing. But we've, but we've hit 37,000 followers today, which is absolutely mental. Um, crazy support recently, and obviously on the last video, I do really, really appreciate it as well. So if you can drop me a like and subscribe, it does mean the world. So now I'm going to go to the local supermarket, get some food and make tea for this evening, and then have a walk down by the front, by the harbour, uh, see if there's any big yachts and nice cars, and then we'll get going tomorrow with the run and first gym session while being in my bear. Let's go. Before we go anywhere, I'll just show you the view quickly, so as you can see. I mentioned earlier, so a few links in there maybe. Bye. We're gonna head back home now, get some food in, freshen up, and then head over to that Club Adele gym. See what the hype is. It looks unbelievable on Instagram, so we'll have a look. Uh, hope get some good content, get that posted, and then there's a pool where I'm staying, so we're gonna jump in there. So if you put a few clips of that in there in the vlog, and yeah, just enjoy the afternoon. But weather's about 21 degrees, it's about half 11 right now, so really, really nice place. And uh, yeah, I'll definitely be back, but I'll catch you at breakfast. So just getting some breakfast in now, as you can see, four eggs, barbecue sauce and toast. Decided not to buy any butter from the shop, stupid enough, so I had to use Oli Oli, editing a reel as we go, and getting my electrolytes back in with some of this stuff as well. Absolutely bang on, tastes so good. to the gym and I'm following the maps I'm thinking surely not but this is, seems to be the path to get up they just do things differently in Spain I swear to god but weather's nice and warm to be fair um, but literally just wearing and they love a beep in the horn as well but literally just wearing gym shark shorts the five inch sports shorts along with um, a rival vest in blue underneath which I'll show you after but yeah about a 15 minute walk to the gym Catch you there. So 
So just made it to Real Club Adele. Um, it's as I thought it would be, to be fair, pretty cool. Um, massive gym, absolutely huge. There's a class going on to the side of me right now. Um, and I'm in the CrossFit park, but as you walk through the reception, there's hairdressers, there's restaurants, there's food. Literally in the background, there's boxing rings across through here as well. Gymnastics, everything. But as you walk through reception, you come into like, the main gym, uh, and then you come out to where all the trees are that you see on Instagram, and we're down these steps into where I am now. But yeah, really cool. <clears throat> the plan for this session is I've got bench press and cleans, a strength work, uh, and obviously then with this morning's run, that's double session done but yeah looking forward to it and some good conditioning as well but yeah this gym is complete vibes you can tell up at the gym now it's a bit too dark to actually film anything with good lighting so we're going to come back tomorrow first thing and get loads of clips here and then but yeah sick gym to be fair i'll see you then so currently editing the video uh, that you're going to be watching so far uh this is the dinner i knew i'd pull through with it on one of these from the shop perfect for all the running and everything that i'm doing as well good morning it's sunday bit overcast today but i think the sun's gonna try and burn through uh, the plan of action today though is get in the gym early get training get as many clips as possible the thing is with here the sunset isn't till say like 20 past six like it'll go pitch black like yesterday what i'm gonna do is spend all day at the gym uh, and then later on go down to the bay again like i did on the run yesterday and uh yeah hopefully have a look around and see what's about but yeah looking forward to today as you know it's like it's quite cool as you can see jumper on track is on as well it's nowhere near as hot today i think it's like 18 degrees um compared to obviously yesterday being 22 23 um, but that's what i'm here for it's, per it's perfect for that i did say on friday it'd be like warm weather training that's clearly a lie uh, and that's not gonna happen either but not too much to worry about uh, however yesterday i was running in my alpha flies i did get a blister um obviously this is the second time i've run in them now so i've just clearly got to run them in a bit more now i'm gonna eat some breakfast and then head over to the gym day two back at padel um as you know, back in the same place as yesterday. I feel like this CrossFit part is probably the best bit in the gym for me. Um, it's away from all the, the the main machines and kind of stuff, but all you need is a rig realistically for what I'm training. Today I've got back and a little bit of a wad, so I'll go through on uh, through the video as well. Um, if I don't talk, I'll just put myself in a little clip in the corner and we'll talk through it together. Uh, but yeah, I'm gonna go through some pull-ups, um, some weighted stuff. I also wanna work on my handstand press-ups and also my handstand holds as well. Um, and then I'm going to do some conditioning on the bike with some burpees as well. But yeah, should be a fun session. New vest from Pure Sport. Gonna try it out. I haven't worn it yet. Looks pretty cool. Let's see how we get on. Let's go. So that's weighted pull-ups and normal pull-ups done. Gonna work on some headstand holds and some headstand push-ups now uh, before going into a conditioning circuit on the bike and burpees. Not looking forward to it, but it's all worth it. Uh, getting quite warm now, it was overcast earlier, but the sun's really starting to come out and it's gonna be a good day. Let's go.
Yo, so just headed down to the harbour uh, to find some food. This is the fit for this evening. The boat's absolutely mad. I ran around here uh, yesterday, so if you recognise any of it, that's why. Um, but yeah, mad place to be fair. I definitely want to come back again. Like when I went to Dubai, I didn't, wasn't really a fan of it that much, but here is absolutely sick. But these yachts are unbelievable. The one down there is absolutely huge. Um, but yeah, so go and find some food and I'll catch you later. Good morning, it is Monday currently, as you can see, overcast as hell, um, not hot at all today, so t-shirt and the joggers on. Um, gonna have a walk down to the local bakery uh, and see what's about, so in the next clip you'll obviously see that. Any recommendations, if you're coming to Marb soon, you know exactly where to go. Uh, I think it's called Ground or something like that, so they look insane on Instagram, so I'll let you know what it's like. Uh, but yeah, busy day for me, so I need to edit this vlog that's coming out on Wednesday, 6 p.m. Uh, and I also need to content post as well on Instagram. Uh, and yeah, and then obviously I've got other meetings with other things as well, which is really exciting stuff. Um, so keep an eye on Instagram for that. I'll link that right here. Uh, but yeah, we hit a thousand subs last night, which is absolutely crazy. Uh, just to think that a thousand of you want to actually see, see the journey on one, the 70.3 prep and two, just my YouTube journey as well, which is quite cool. Uh, so I do really appreciate it all. But yeah, this is what these settings are like in Marbella at the moment. It's a, like, it's a crazy view, but uh, it's a shame it's overcast. But yeah, fly back tomorrow at 2 p.m. Um, so just going to get as much work done today as possible, but I'll see you on the walk to the new bakery. Let's go. Bakery has been found. Going to try it out and I'll let you know what the recommendations are like and we'll go from there. So this is what we've gone for. So salmon and eggs and then also a pan, a pan chocolat and an almond croissant with Nutella on it and orange juice. That is an unbelievable breakfast. Mm. That is so good. for our first session of the week um, leg day so everything in this in this program that I'm using at the moment obviously for my hybrid program uh, and then obviously my CrossFit it's also helping me with my 70.3 prep so a lot of single leg unilateral stuff and obviously then like your squats RDLs all that kind of stuff as well so I help improve my running but also my strength around everything else within the hybrid that I'm obviously doing as well so lifting and running at the same time uh, but yeah working towards that it's Monday let's get it done Last night in Marbella, so I thought I'd treat myself to an ice cream. I've got Lotus and Oreo, and it's unreal. I'm gonna go home now and cook chicken and pesto. Looking forward to it. I'll be quite happy to get back into the UK, to be fair. I think we'll get back into routine. I've missed the early morning. It sounds really weird, but I've missed the early morning of getting up and swimming, uh, and also getting on the bike. But I checked earlier, and I'm 153 days away from my 70.3, so it's really time to dial in and get into uh, full focus mode. 
and just keep kicking on with training. But yeah, it's uh, it's been a good, a good. I, I wouldn't even say it's been a break. It hasn't been a break because I've still been training, getting all my content in. Like that's the whole point of coming out, coming away. Like when I go on holiday now, it's not about oh just going to relax. Like it, I find it really boring. I actually find going on holiday like I lose routine and it's not what I want. So being able to still train and stuff like that, like it's not a a hot. It's a hobby. It's not a chore to go training for me. So I'll be quite happy to get back to it and uh, and yeah, keep going. But I'll enjoy this and I'll catch you back at the apartment. I did say in, I think, my last video that I post on YouTube, um, I eat the same thing every single day. I'm not even joking. So chicken, pasta. Obviously, normally it's rice, but I was trying to treat myself with pasta for both nights. I uh, had that ice cream earlier. That was absolutely banging. Uh, but yeah, back to routine now. And obviously, fly back to the UK tomorrow. Quite excited to boil. been again half six, first thing in the morning, Wednesday, uh, with CrossFit on the evening, I believe. And then we'll go from there, ready to hit another week strong. And I think we'll be like, below 150 days out then from the event which is going to be absolutely mental i'll catch you tomorrow first thing good morning so it is the last day in marbella gonna to head to the airport in about an hour and a half so we need to get a taxi uh from the bottom as we're like right in the sticks up here i didn't realize how hilly marbella actually is um so plenty plenty of steps done this weekend uh, and plenty of work done as well really happy with the content that we've got and obviously back to the grind tomorrow on the routine as I said last night in terms of swimming uh, with CrossFit on the evening. There's a police car behind me, I'm trying to get this film before he, uh, it comes past me. Um, and then get back in gym on Thursday, etc. But yeah, so as a whole, I don't know how many calories I've consumed this weekend, don't ever track anymore anyway. Um, but obviously because of the amount of expenditure, like I said in the last video, calories have gone out the window this weekend pretty much. So plenty of pastries, loads of carbs, ice cream, pizza, but still getting the training done. So. In terms of routine now, getting back in, like I mentioned earlier, uh, food shop will be done first thing tomorrow, and then after that, it's uh, it's back it's back into the full swing. But because of the amount of training I'm doing as well, using those carbs is never going to affect you anyway. So if you're doing hybrid, then I totally recommend just not like going absolutely crazy, but having a bit of having a, what's the word? But you're having a bit of discipline around those foods as long as you're using it to the right amount. Um, so obviously with with all those carbs I've used this weekend. I've ran, I've gymmed, I've done all that stuff I've needed to do. Been out of the house for ages in terms of being at the gym, getting content, like you're burning it off. So, but you're able to enjoy the foods that you want to enjoy. Uh, if, say, for instance, I was in the bodybuilding like I used to, if I was to eat that much carb and like not do the same amount of exercise and expenditure, I think I'd be in a bit of a, a sorry state with a lot of water weight on me. But in turn, but because of that, we're in a good place, I think so anyway. Uh, that is this morning wrapped up. Uh, gonna get some breakfast now from Obeya to the airport. So just arrived at the airport now, uh, finishing off some editing work on this YouTube video, along with um, some Instagram content too. I've got about an hour and a bit till the gate opens, so pretty chill uh, for the time being. Uh, this trip has been quite successful in terms of getting the content I wanted to get. I still managed to get some training done. Change of scenery is always good as well. If you enjoyed this vlog, please don't forget to drop me a like, and I'll see you on the next episode of the 70.3 Prep. Oh, I almost say.